Prepare for the curtain call of a gripping military saga as season seven gears up for production, slated to grace screens in 2024, bidding adieu to the acclaimed series. With heartfelt appreciation, executive producers Spencer Hudnut and Christopher Chulak paid tribute to seven seasons of storytelling that honored the valor and sacrifices of those in service. They hailed the exceptional ensemble, from actors to crew, and lauded the invaluable contributions of numerous veterans behind the scenes. While yearning to continue advocating for service members post-season seven, they rallied the SEAL Team community to stand firm in their support. David Boreanaz, both lead actor and executive producer, reflected on the privilege of six seasons alongside an outstanding team. He expressed gratitude to fans for their unwavering support and emphasized the series' commitment to shedding light on contemporary struggles. Anticipation brimmed as he looked ahead to season seven, promising a conclusion filled with affection and gratitude. The last season witnessed the departure of Max Tyrio's character, prompting the arrival of Rafi Barsoumian as Foxtrot transfer Omar Hamza, adding new dynamics to the team. Season 6's finale saw Jason Hayes revealing his battle scars, including a traumatic brain injury, amidst a tense ceremony, prompting scrutiny from higher-ups. The powerful scene unfolded as other team members unveiled their own hidden battles, from headaches to memory lapses, echoing the toll of their relentless service. David Stapp, president of CBS Studios, commended the producer's unwavering commitment to authenticity in honoring veterans and service members. He applauded the series for its powerful performances and narratives, eagerly anticipating a seventh and final season filled with satisfaction and resonance. But I want to hear what you think. Are you sad that the SEAL team is ending? Please leave me a comment down below.